Yeah, hello guys, Tick here, welcome back. And we are in the headquarters. I haven't I still haven't done anything with this underground. I I have to admit I'm a little bit stumped. I'm not sure exactly what I what I want to do with this. I think it's also a little bit low, but I don't I don't really want to take it up a bit. Because I don't really want to expose the top of the uh the portals, you know. I kinda wanna just leave them where they are and I need to clear this out. Alright, let's just make sure the quarry has not got stuck. Nah, it seems to be okay. Alright. So, what I did was um, I got the wireless access terminal. And what I have done is uh, stick this wireless booster in it, but it's, it's not actually even all that good. I mean, works here, but over here, nothing nothing. Here. That's 16 blocks. That's all you get. So, for me to be able to use this anywhere else in the building, what I need to do is move that block sort of over there-ish in the middle, and I need to have one on every floor. Which, okay, it's not a big deal, and that's, you know, part of what we wanted to do with interconnectivity and stuff, but it's a bit of a hassle. I'm I'm almost tempted to go and change the config for applied logistics and just maybe even just double the range. So 16 unboosted, 32 boosted, but I don't know. Part of this is about working within the constraints of the systems that we got, so... and trying not to abuse things too much, you know, or at all, if, it, if, if at all possible, so... Yeah, yeah. Not sure. Not sure. Okay, what else have we done? Well, we put in another storage disk this time. We uh, went out of our way to try and get a 64k storage. It's expensive. Uh, and rightly so, obviously. You, 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 can't, you shouldn't be able to just jump straight into these. It takes four diamonds. It takes about 40 silicon. Uh, it takes a bunch of other stuff. It's, <coughs> it's, it's quite expensive. It takes a little bit of time to get to it as well. But we got to it, and it's well it's decent but now now that we've got the system really what we need to start doing is something with all the stuff that we're going to be putting in there so I'd like to get this set up before we go and so what I'm going to be doing is building an assembly I also filled in this floor with the uh, glass viewer I love it it's just almost clear you can't really you can't really see it it's good Let's go to the moon base. Alright, so what we're going to be crafting is an assembler. And the assembler is, is a multi-block item. So something that you have to kind of build up. And we're going to build what I think is probably the most basic shape uh, to get a decent decent one going. So for that we're going to need these things, ME assembler containment walls. And these are needed against all the corner blocks, essentially. Uh, not necessarily just the corners themselves, but, um, you know, wherever there is a corner, a vertex. Vertex, whatever. Then we're going to need these, we're going to need at least 16 of these. I hope, actually, I have enough iron bars there. Because we need to do four on each side with the build that we've gone for. No, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. That is just dreadful. Okay, so that's one, four. So one more of those. Stick that in there and there. Do 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 do. There we go. We're gonna need the semi cable, so let's just hold on to that. Okay, so these make up the basic structure. Basically, you build up a frame of the containment wall, and then you fill in the sides with the heat vents, but you need something to go in the middle, uh, something to hold patterns and something to, you know, process all that stuff. So for that, we're going to be building pattern providers. Now these things are also, again, quite expensive. Um, they take two conversion matrices, which admittedly aren't too expensive, but they also require an advanced processor each. So they're, they're about a diamond plus some iron 
redstone and quartz, plus you also need the storage cells. So we're going to build four of those, because once we build this setup, we'll have eight blocks in the middle that we need to fill up. And the other block that we're going to be sticking in there is the crafting CPU. The crafting CPU uh, speeds up the process of crafting. I think you only need one to be able to actually even start the crafting. But each one speeds up the process by which you craft stuff. And again, that's well, kind of expensive. A diamond for each one, some glowstone, and the rest of it not too bad. So we're going to get four of those in as well. Now some of these things aren't worth anything unless we have another tool. Uh, and this is the pattern encoder. Pattern encoder, fairly cheap actually. And the pattern encoder allows us to encode these blank patterns. And you, what you do is you put your crafting recipe in and the desired output, and the and then you write the pattern basically. So we're just gonna we're gonna have a couple of these. We're not gonna do too much. So let's just pop back out. I'm presuming that we're going to need to A, to connect it to the network, and B, give it power. Yeah, right, 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 right. So we're going to build this just over here. My plan is actually to have another one. Uh, and in fact, we might move this setup over here and try and do more computery stuff on this floor. But for now, it's enough that we're just going to build this over here. So it's four blocks wide, so this is just just about perfect. We're gonna uh, build it over here. So this is just it's a four by four by four cube. Looks like we built exactly enough. That's that's pretty good planning. Okay, we're not going to put those in just yet. We're going to put in some of these just to give us a little bit more structure. Uh, did I actually build enough of these? I don't think I did. No, no, definitely not. Definitely not. So we're going to have to go back and build four more of these. Uh, eight more. Wow. Okay, let's go and do that now. to double check because I've got a quarry uh, running beneath here and um, because my setup isn't so good I still get I think I'm sure I've mentioned this before but I get uh, any bees that come in uh, they block up the system so that's that's no good all right uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. So, oh no that was a bad idea wasn't it Mental note, do not shift click. Okay, so we just need eight more of these. Should have enough. Oh, no, not quite. Mm -mm -mm -mm. And eight. There we go. And we're going to grab that back. Okay, that should be us sorted then. Oh, that's even better. It doesn't actually do the... the sort of sparkly effect. That's awesome. Alright. I'm gonna stick that in there. Let's just do... I don't think this actually serves any purpose, but... I love doing stuff like this, so... Alright. Boom! Look at that! Look at that! Automatically changes. And we've got four pages of patterns that we can stick in there. That's good. Alright. Now, before this can any do anything, it obviously needs to be on the network. So... Uh, keeping in line with our doing stuff with supposed trunking. I'm just going to drop this over here. 
There we go. There we go. I don't think it needs power. Let's just check here. What is this? All right. So this just this sorts it all out basically. Okay. Right, not too shabby. Not too shabby. Alright, we're just going to stick this right... ...here. Alright, uh... Let's, um... We're going to, we're going to encode something basic, really basic. Let's just do a furnace. So, if we stick that over there and that over there, I believe this is how it works. Boom. Okay, crafts one furnace with eight cobblestone. So we're going to drop this and pop that in there. All right, and you can see. Oh, if I if I just pop that in there, our f furnace now has a uh, craft la label on it. So if we just click on that, we're going to want one. So we say craft. Boom! There it is. We can pull it out. Excellent. All right, I'm going to have to make a lot more of these, but I've got a number of pages that I can hold in there, so that's quite good. I like the look of this thing. It's it really fits with the the whole industrial thing. But after reading about it a little bit, um, I think the release that we're currently on, uh, you can't really go much too much bigger before it starts to, for some reason, strain the the server that it's sitting on so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna mess about with it too much I will probably make one or two more of those maybe when I move that stuff I'll make a this a bank of them with the other things over here but I need to obviously fill that up because I want whoop, nothing on that so it will fill up that one first before it fill up that one and that's okay we're going to replace that one, and we will probably stick multiple drives on here instead of just having one drive array. We'll we'll have a bank of them, you know, like a proper server, something, something actually, you know, normal, right? Oof. It's been an interesting uh, journey going through all these things because I, I I love this kind of stuff. So, and this is this is exactly why I like. Feed the beast. It's these are the things that I want to play around with. Okay, so this is probably going to be a very short episode because I didn't. Uh, I had some plans, but um, unfortunately, my evening got eaten up by something else. So I didn't really. I don't really have the time to uh, do all the stuff that I really wanted to. Unfortunately, so there is that. What I wanted to look at as well, though, were these blocks. Road. Plastic sheets, which is raw plastic, which you get from smelting rubber or rubber bars. Rubber bars come from the rubber. Ah. That could be quite interesting. Might be worth playing around with those because apparently, uh, oh wait, uh, here, road lights. So they're basically just those roadblocks, but um, they just light up. So it might actually, one of the things that we need to do is uh, if we go back up here. Oh, actually, hmm. No, I, I have no idea exactly what I'm going to do with this particular area. Uh, this... this one. We still need to build in here. Uh, firstly, 
a place that we sleep. Oh yeah, did I actually sell you this? Oh yeah, this is exactly what I was going for. So, just in case. I may have actually shown you, but I'll show you again. Okay, um, yeah, I'm going to cut this one short. I, I'm very tired, and my evening was kind of taken up by a whole bunch of other stuff. Uh, as from next week, we will be back onto our regular schedule, because I only did these extra videos because I missed out Monday and I felt bad about it. So, yeah, sorry about this. It's See, now I feel kind of bad about <laughs> cutting short this video, even though I've put out two extra vid uh, an extra video this week. So you've gotten more time out of me, and yet I still feel bad because I'm going to cut this one short. You people are horrible to me. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching, you guys. Comment, like, and subscribe, and all that other stuff. Share with your friends, or the uh, kittens get it. And I will catch you next time. Ta-ta.